Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Kerry and this is my budgeting journey. Today I'm going to be doing my cash driven for week five of May. It's just a half week, so I've got half of my usual weekly allowance here. Um, and I'll be stuffing that into my file of facts ready for this week. So to get started, I'm just going to count the money. So I've got 20, 40, 60, 80, 91, 110, 115, 120, 125, and then I've got five pounds here, so that's 130. So 130 in total. Um, and I'll explain what the coins are for in a minute. Just pop it in there. Yeah, I get paid on Tuesday, so it's just a half week here, but if I don't allocate any money, I wouldn't have managed to stretch it from last week's. Um, so yeah. And I've just got one of the old £20 notes left, which I'll use in my groceries. Perfect. Okay, can you see? Okay, so I've just done my check-in. My final facts is mostly empty, apart from the ones that I roll over. Um, so to start with, I think groceries is going to get its normal, well, 30 it is, because it usually gets 60 for a whole week. So just 30 will do for half a week. And if I don't use this week, I'll get rolled over into challenges or into June. Household is still getting its five. We do need a couple of things. I cannot get Dishomatic heads anywhere just now. I uh, don't know what it is, but I just can't get them anywhere. Fuel, I rolled over 30 because we haven't yet filled the car up. So I'm just going to add 10 that is meant for this week and then we'll probably just fill the 40. Because we do need it, it's just that we've not done it yet. Miscellaneous is getting five. And then spending is also getting a, well, it's actually getting a 10 this week. I'm going to be doing my spending up to £10 a week. And I'm going to just be doing what everybody else does budget with Ira, um, budget with M does it. Um, Millie's just started doing it from Living Life with a Budget. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to just start giving myself £10 and then doing the dice challenge from Budget with Ira and putting towards that and then whatever's left over is going into my spending. I just think it's a good idea just to get it started, to be honest, because when else am I going to have change to do the challenge, if that makes sense? Like, I, yeah, just it makes sense to do, I think. Um, and then that's going to be my personal savings. Um, and then nobody else in this one's getting anything. So I'm just going to do the challenge just now so that I can then put that back in. So here's today's challenge. In my checker I've done £3. So I'm just going to get the dice. One. Oh, that's good. <laughs> Everybody I watch seems to get like the high numbers, so... I mean, I'll obviously have to come to the high number at some point. I'm quite happy with that. So I'm just going to colour in this little one. Okay. I'm so glad that I've started this now. So yeah, so there's £4 in there at the moment. I can't remember how much it saves me for the life of me. I think it's like... Is either the engine 10 or the engine 30? Can't remember. And then this remainder, um, then pound, is going to. Do you know what actually I'm going to do? Basically, because this is new, I swapped out a five from a team of friends, and Ryan didn't have any change, so I asked him for. Uh, no, I didn't have any change, so I asked Ryan to swap out five for five pound coins, but he never had five pound coins. But what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put this towards this new challenge that I've got. Now, this is the 50p challenge. Um, it was from Moo Budget. She kindly sent me it as a thank you for helping her out with it. Um, and I asked her for this in this colour. Um, and it comes with a little envelope. She gave me that as well. And I'm just going to put them in there just now because I don't usually have eight pounds anyway. For my spending so if i've spent it i'd be really surprised so i'm just going to knock off another two 
it's just a good start to this challenge so yeah i don't think it's on her etsy as as of yet but i'm sure she's adding it soon and it saves you 25 pounds when you've got all the 50 p's um i just thought it was a really good idea and so this is going to spend in money good good so that's all for this week and then i've got i'm just trying to think i've done a rejiggle in all my wallets and i can't remember which one's which i think it's all going here anyway so we've got this is my like kind of longer term joint one um this is going into holiday i've got 40 pounds for holiday if you watch my budget with me it was meant to be going towards florida and then i booked a last minute holiday caravan so i'm just putting it in here just in case so it's 20 40 60 70 80 90 1 120 130 140 150 160 170 we're only going for four nights so i'm aiming for 200 and i think 20 and i think that'll do us for like kind of fuel as well um so florida does not get anything wedding is getting 20 Not in any sort of order and then wedding's got 20 40 60 81 20 40 60 82 220 230 240 and if nobody has watched my videos before we are getting married next september um and we've already booked the venue and stuff we pay monthly 300 pounds out of our like direct debit i transfer over but it's just to get a wee um, extra money for like things that we do need to pay for outstanding, like the Piper and um, DJ, etc. So, emergency is getting a 10. And we're going to do one more. This tracker, again, if you've not watched before, is from What If I Fly 17 on Etsy. She can do like change this, change the amount, and change all the denominations depending on what you're wanting. Um, but it's a great idea. I think I, I really do enjoy it for like different holidays and emergencies. So I've got 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82. 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 3, 310, 320, 330. So we're well on our way with our emergency. I've been trying to add, um, if I've got any side hustle money, so just a little bit, even if it is another 10 hour. And that is me. So that's me for today. Um, I would just like to say thank you for everybody who is supporting me and is supporting me and thank you for all the likes, comments and subscribers. Um, it really does keep me accountable and if there's anything that you would like to see on my channel, please do let me know. Um, even if it's something like a sink and fun count up at the end of the month or just count up what I've got my challenges because I did show my um, previous video that I've I done that last month, but I didn't do it on camera. So if it's something that you would like to see, please just let me know. Um, and yeah, I'll see you for my either budget with me or my check-in for five, week five of me, depending on what comes out first. Um, and yeah, I hope you all enjoy. Have a lovely weekend. Bye-bye.